let's get going. Alright, pitching clutch. for telling me White Sox, we ain't beat these guys. Great look there at U.S. Cellular Field on the south side of Chicago as MLB The Show gets set for another edition of Major League Baseball. And this is fouled back and out of play. Trying to bunt his way aboard, but this will get fouled. Certainly no offer at that one. It's one and two. And now a pitch on the way. Just did get a piece of that one, so he stays alive here. Ball two. Spins and pulls this one down the line at first. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at two and two. And a tough pitch on two strikes as he's able to foul it off. And he'll fight just to stay alive here as this is foul. Enjoying this gameplay, guys? <laughs> And then they hit it. And that's going to find its way through, so the dangerous Pierre is aboard on a leadoff single. Yeah, and this afternoon's off to a good start for these guys already. They had a 1 2 3 top half, and now they've got their leadoff man on here. There goes Pierre. Of course. And it's a stolen base for Juan Pierre. Pulls the string on the circle change, but it's taken for ball one. And as a number two hitter, you've got to get that guy to third so the three, four, and five guys can get him home and get you the lead. And this is in the air to straightaway right. We'll see if it's enough to get that runner to third. Punto is there to put it away for route number one. Ah, oh, who's a Batista, we'll really? Shot at it here. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. If he can drive this runner in, that would be RBI number 49. Fastball got him to swing through it. It's one and one. From the belt, the pitch. And this one's up around the eyes. Two and one. And it misses. Three and one now. And like most guys, the further ahead in the count he gets, the more dangerous he becomes. He'll lock in in a zone now and hurt you if he guesses right. Payoff pitch coming. Oh, got him. As he couldn't pull the trigger and there are two away. Well, and you have to remember that even the best hitters in baseball fail seven times. Adam Dunn. This is just a great pitch and a great spot, so that's one where you just tip your hat and move on. Adam Dunn stands in as he looks at a cold strike. As a look, now the pitch. Big swing by Dunn, but he's behind in the count now, 0-2. Oh, 
And you can tell he's looking for something to pull because he was way ahead there. Now yeah, I got him. Toward the alley and left they didn't get a run in, yeah. Gordon will make the catch to retire the side. White Sox come up empty first time around. We'll head to the second in Chicago. No score. Alex Rios. will stand in, getting the start here despite being out of the lineup last night. In there, 0-1. Wow, he is spotting that fastball on a dime here early on. Now a swing and a fly ball hit fairly well out to deep center field. Kane is back, though, as he makes the catch on the track for the first out. Man, these guys are stacked. Here. Took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. And a fastball's in there for strike one. Now the 0 1 is swung on and hit on the ground a third. On the Butler in time, and there are two away. A.J. Krasinski will get his first cuts here. Now here's the first pitch. Now a swing, and here's another. Oh, nice. Down there at third. Look at Betamy. And a low throw that time, but good footwork there by Butler as he's able to hang with it, and the inning is over. One, two, three, go to White Sox. Orlando Hudson. Third with no score. Orlando Hudson makes his way to the plate to get us started here in the bottom of inning number three. Udog's out. Throws in time, and that's out number one. Leadoff man retired now for Gregor Blanco. Oh, I just traded this. We, we just traded this dude to them. Fouled straight back. swung on and lifted down the left field line but it'll get back into the crowd as he jumps ahead of him now 0-2 oh, and, and here's yeah. a in there for a full third strike and that's the second out of the inning back to the top of the order now and the team's catalyst Juan Pierre's coming up and he'll try to bunt his way on as he gets this one down. Oh, of course, he's going in there. And the throw is too late. He's on with a beautifully placed bunt single. Well, with the top of the order at the plate, you always have to be wary of this possibility, even with two outs. Now the question becomes, will they put him in motion? Alexi Ramirez is at the plate now as he looks at strike one. And with two outs and the number two hitter at the plate, this is a good time to steal, so you'd better keep your eye on him over there at first base. But this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. And Ramirez is able to hold off on that one, but he still trails in the count. It's one and two. Check on Pierre, now the pitch. And now it's oh, two. really? This one high in the air. Of course, Alexi Ramirez hits it. Starting to look, he's Jordan, but not to worry. This one is gone. A home run. I don't like that circle chat. If I remember from the last video, that's the pitch that got me home run last time. White Sox move in front two to nothing. Now the fastball here is swung on and grounded foul. He got him out of his front foot. It's 0-2. Bases are empty here with two men out. Swing and a ball line down in the left field corner. But this will be foul. And a fastball. Full strike three and the side is retired. Uh, hopefully they can get a couple points. Two in the inning for the Sox, however. They come on this two-run home run. We played three full. It's now 2 nothing. Good guy. Adam Dunn is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself down a strike. It's 0-1. And, and that almost had a little cutting action to it that time. Grounded foul. Now here's the pitch. That misses 1-2. and two. I don't trust that circle change at all. Why would, why? I'm not pitching that anymore. And it's a little surprising we don't see him try this more often. 
You can see the big shift on the right side of the infield, so what does he do? He hits it to the left side for an easy base hit. Nothing to it. Alex Rios is next as he finds himself behind 0-1. And this is on the ground at first, could be two. Nice double play. Uh, first, and it's a well-turned 3-6-1 double play, and quickly there are two gone. Yeah, very smart play over here at first. He comes off the bag and feels it, then goes immediately to second base, then gets out of the way on the return. That's a nice 3-6-1 right there. Just the way the guy to my left used to do it. And he's able to get there on the long run, and he covered a lot of ground there as the side is retired. Okay, we tied it up. That's good. He's 0 for 1 thus far. And this ball's going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. Good throw gets him one gun. So one away now for the O-Dog, Orlando Hudson. Too high, 1-0. Oh. Another really close pitch there. He's been around the strike zone quite a bit. You know, sometimes that can be good. Other times, though, it can make you a little too predictable out there. 2-0 count, the pitch. Opposite field to left, in there, the base hit. And if you'll watch Hudson at the plate, watch it. He starts with those hands down low, but then as the pitch comes in... All right, I need to work on this circle change. He rips this one it for a sucks. Swing and a ball chop foul down the left side. This is low, ball two, two and one. Yeah, and he'll look for something a little higher here. Now he gets the ground ball to first. This might be two. Gets nice. One. And good hustle by the pitcher there on the back end as it's a three to six to one double play, and the side is retired. We'll join this one here in the bottom of the sixth, already in progress. Just got a piece of it as it's fouled back. Ball and he's quickly in the hold, 0-2. And, and this guy's got two of their five hits, so he's trying to make it three out of six. And he just manages to stay alive here as he fights this one foul. <laughs> 0 2 pitch is swung on and lifted in the air out to center field. Kane is right there, one down. You see this ball start slicing away from him toward the end here, but he winds up staying right with it and running it down. Now the first come on, Alexi, let's go. And he's oh, come on. With, well, it looked like a strike, but it's ruled a ball, 1-0. Oh. Hmm. We've seen that same pitch be called a strike more than once. Yeah, that's what I thought. Alexi. Butler in time, and there are two away. Jose Bautista will stand in, 0 for 2 thus far. Swing and he takes this the other way to right. Oh, nice. And he'll reach down to make the play on the run. A fine defensive effort there, retired to side. We'll move forward in this one and rejoin the action in the bottom of the seventh. Here's one hit towards the hole. Throw on to first takes care of Dunn as the shift does its job, and there's one away. So the leadoff man gone now for Alex Rios. Swing and a ball popped high in the air and heading for foul territory behind first. And Butler will take control of this one for route number two. So with two gone now, that'll bring in Paul Canerco. Hold, strike one on the circle change. Good pitch. And now that Royals bullpen will get busy as we see both the southpaw and the right-hander get loose. Right there, and it's quickly 0-2 now. Hits are even right now at five aside. And a good 
good curveball there, but he wouldn't bite. It's one and two. Going a little more with a breaking ball here as he goes along. We didn't see it as much the first few times through. Here he comes again, one, two. Just a bit low, a tough call, but it's two and two. And give him some credit up there. This was looking like it could be a very quick inning, but at least he's been able to stretch out this at bat. And this ball is also hit foul and heading for the seat, so we'll have to do it again. Still two and two. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, three and two. And even three, two, I don't know if you want to challenge him here. Better to put him on than to give up a solo home run. And he gets wow. there as he had a Lance lot of Bergman's cover doing some work the out there. Retired. Down in order go the White Sox. Score remains deadlocked at 2-2. So that's a wrap here tonight. Matt Vaskersian, Dave Campbell, Eric Harris. This has been a presentation huh. of MLB 11, the show. They didn't get the win, but online, we, we did win. Just I didn't get the, the win. The Royals come out on top 7-5. To what came Soria made up for himself for the last loss with getting a save. Good job, dude.